amarse, mujer. That brought tears to my eyes. <laughs> What was your reaction when she came to you and said, I'm going to be a singer, I'm going to join this band? I said, no. <laughs> no? Yep, that's pretty, pretty much no. it. No. What was tough to tell her was, Mom, I want to join this band because it was going to be for fun. Rhythm is going to get you. Gloria and a founder of the Miami Sound Machine, Emilio, have been married for 36 years, but mom didn't approve of him at first. Yeah, Emilio told me that you're a tough nut to crack. Yes, it took him a lot, but he's the best thing that happened to me. Eventually. And to her. Eventually. <laughs> it took her a while to realize it. This was the it's first. The first one. The only one. She put like a four. A yeah. big giant wall. She and once even slammed a door in his face. She doesn't remember, but well, I Well, it wasn't a slam the door. <laughs> Let me explain you that because it's a, it's a matter of, it's a, it's a culture Semantics, drink. Semantics, I it's guess. It's a culture drink. When I visited Gloria's mom's house, I found out just how feisty she can get. I, I am a little bit taller than you. I'm 5'3". Yeah. Oh, yeah. My, it's Drink. That's what it says on her driver's license. Five three. Five but three. she took. She right went, now I am four six. She I'm was in, in heels. In Gloria and her mom are super close, and when the singer was injured in that 1990 tour bus crash, her mom feared the worst. And I heard Gloria Stefan dead in an, in an automobile accident. That was the first thing that it was said. She flew to her daughter's hospital bedside and didn't like what she saw. She was signing pictures for the doctor in the hospital. Yeah, that was a little And hairy. I was crying. I said, don't do that. She was laying down all tied up. Yeah, because I was on a board with my neck brace on. It had to be a life to describe what I feel when I have her. OK, I don't want to make you cry now. No. It's no crying cry. aloud. That's my rule. So tell me, what's the most important lesson that you've learned from your mom? First of all, I never grew up thinking that there was nothing a woman couldn't do. My mother went out, she worked, she put us through prep school, she redid her uh, credentials as a teacher. Uh, she, never, she never sat on her laurels or, or did anything halfway.